Galaxy's 2018 from Samsung to LG, here's what to expect at the biggest tech show. Sees, the world's largest tech show held in Las Vegas, Nevada, will start early next week with tech companies from around the world revealing what they will have up for sale in the coming months. Over the past few years, Sees, or the Consumer Electronics Show, has become the trendsetter in the field of technology, and this year will no different. New TVs, smart speakers, smart home appliances, driverless cars, laptops, wearables, robots, and smartphones are expected to be unveiled from known and lesser known manufacturers. Some of the biggest names in technology space including Samsung, LG, Sony, Intel, Qualcomm, along with smaller companies descend on Las Vegas for the week. Here's what you can expect from C's 2018 Samsung The South Korean major Samsung will be talking about its upcoming products at its press conference which takes place on January 8th. Samsung has already announced that the Galaxy A8 and A8 Plus, company's Galaxy S8-inspired premium mid-end smartphone, will be showcased for the first time at C's 2018. Other than the A8 series, the company has also announced a trio of new Windows 10 laptops, including the 2018 edition of the Notebook 7 Spin. The convertible, 2-inch minus 1 Windows 10 laptop with active pen support will be on display. We already know about three new products under its C-Lab projects, S-Ray, a directional speaker, Relumino, a smart glasses for those with vision challenges, and Go Breath a recovery device for people who have experienced lung damage. Then there is the Thunderbolt 3 clit curved monitor and the company also announced the launch of its latest mobile processor, the Exynos 9 Series 9810. The press conference will likely play host to more than just the launch of new TVs and home appliances. Samsung is expected to tease the Galaxy S9 for the first time before it officially launches the flagship at MWC 2018 in late February. At C's 2018, Samsung could also formally announce the Galaxy X, its first commercially available flexible display smartphone. LG don't expect to see any big surprises from LG's press conference. LG has said that it will show off the largest 8K OLED TV as well as the Think OLED and Super UHD TVs at C's 2018. The new series will use artificial intelligence, AI, to interact with users, thanks to the integration of Google Assistant. There is a new Raspberry Rose V30 smartphone, a 150-inch 4K projector that supports HDR10 and the Think, a Google Assistant-powered smart speaker. Expectations are not very high from LG's press conference, things could change at the last minute. There's a strong buzz of the arrival of a new K-series smartphone at C's 2018. Rumors also point to the launch of the G7 flagship smartphone, though it's less likely the announcement will happen at C's. Sony Every year Sony announces new products at C's in Las Vegas. Sony, even though, hasn't unveiled at new products at this point, but we can expect to see a lot of new devices on January 8th. The company is expected to launch a new range of OLED TVs, premium headphones, next generation of mirrorless cameras, and other products, though we doubt the company will launch its much-awaited bezel-less smartphone at C's. Instead, the announcement might take place at MWC in Barcelona next month. Qualcomm Qualcomm is expected to talk about 5G, the next generation of wireless networks, in detail at C's 2018. While we're not expected to see first generation of smartphones designed for 5G at this year's C's, Qualcomm will instead highlight how consumers can benefit from 5G in 2018. After all, 5G will offer much faster speeds than 4G LTE. In the US, AT&T announced that it expects to introduce mobile 5G service in a number of markets in 2018. Verizon, a major wireless carrier, will launch a 5G network in the second half of the year in the US. Qualcomm will also likely discussing benefits of Windows 10 powered PCs with its Snapdragon chips. Intel Intel has been in the center stage after it revealed that the design flaw found on processors by the company affects millions of Windows PCs and Macs manufactured in the last decade or so. 
but Intel will make sure the controversy doesn't affect the company's new KB Lake G, which incorporates an Intel 8th Gen CPU with a custom-built AMD Radeon GPU. Intel first talked about its collaboration with AMD in November last year. The chipset promises to bring thinner, lighter, and powerful premium laptops. Expect a number of original equipment manufacturers, OEMs, such as Dell and HP announcing laptops with the processor. For all the latest technology news, download.